All right, hey guys, I'm Rose TCG back with a new video. So with this video, I'm gonna be talking about the new prediction princess support. So prediction uh, princess is an archetype based around uh, flip summoning and ritual summoning. So um, this this that this archetype hasn't gotten support in a minute. And yeah, let's see if the support is any good. So this is the first card, prediction princess uh, Biblio Moose, Biblio Muse. If this card is tributed and since the graveyard, you can special summon it in face down defense position. So that's pretty good. Obviously, you're gonna tribute it in order to um, ritual summon the what I assume it to be the level nine ritual monster. And once you do that, you're able to use uh, special summon this card back. And doing so, you can get more value out of it. Maybe you can ritual summon again, or you can just keep it out. Uh, flip, add one prediction princess monster, except this card and one ritual spell from your deck to your hand. So that's a really good flip effect. Just being able to search out a monster and the ritual spell is incredibly good for uh, these type of decks. And yeah, implementing that into a flip effect is really solid. I think this is really good as a flip effect. Your opponent cannot target ritual monsters you control with card effects. Also, they cannot be destroyed by your opponent's card effects. So this looks like a really good card for this archetype. Uh, not only does it special summon itself out when it gets tributed, but it also uh, acts as a search. And it also get, uh, grants your ritual monsters that you, that obviously you probably tributed this monster to summon. You're able to give it protection uh, through card effects, uh, through tar being targeted, and through card effect destruction. So this looks like a really solid card for this archetype. Uh, definitely looks like a good one. And yeah, here we have the ritual monster. So this, this is a Nether Prediction Princess uh, Taro Treat. Uh, you can ritual summon this card with Nether uh, Prediction. A ritual must be ritual summon and cannot and can then be special summoned with prediction princess uh tarot tray you can only use the first and second effect of this card's name once per turn so it's flip effect it lets you special summon one flip monster from your deck and face on defense position monster uh and to end face on defense position so that's pretty good uh just being able to obviously uh, you can target one of these cards or one of the cards, uh, one of the other old support cards uh, that they had. But this looks like the one of the most uh, solid ones you can choose, just because this card does act as a search for two, and uh, being able to get that out is really good. And quick effect, you can activate one of these effects. Change any number of face-up monsters you control to face-up defense position. And change any number of face-up position monsters you control to face-down defense position. So that's really good for obvious reasons. Just being able to. Uh, use this card, special summon a flip monster from your deck and face out on the fence. So you can just uh, special out Prediction Princess Biblio Muse if you don't have it out. And then use this card uh, to flip it, flip it up. And then from there, you're able to search out two cards. So really good ritual monster uh, that synergizes well. And I can see this possibly being used in other... I can see like these type, this type of uh, Prediction Princess may, maybe being mixed with like Ninja or something. Just uh, another flip uh, archetype that can benefit from this type of boss monster. And here we have the final card, which is Nether Prediction Ritual. This card can be used to ritual summon any Prediction Princess monster from your hand or grave in face up attack position or face down defense position. But uh, you must also tribute monsters from your hand or field whose total levels equal or exceed the level of ritual monsters. So yeah, uh, it's just another ritual summon card, but it lets you ritual summon from the hand or grave. And it lets you put them in face up attack or face on the fence position, which is obviously relevant for this type of um, deck uh, that's based around um, flip summoning. So, yeah. And then during the standby phase, if you control Prediction Princess Ritual Monster, you can banish this card from your grave. Special summon, special summon one non uh, ritual Prediction Princess Monster from your deck and face on the fence position. So, that's pretty good. If uh, your Prediction Princess Ritual Monster survives, then you can use this uh, card's effect um, during your standby phase. And if you do it, just you're able to build up more advantage. So it looks like pretty solid support. Uh, these two look really good together. I honestly think for an archetype that I haven't really heard much about, I think a form of like negation would be really great for the deck as well. But this looks pretty solid for them. I hope that people that watch or that uh, play Prediction Princess uh, do like the support. So yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video and want to support the channel, make sure to use the link in the description down below. It'll take you to DCG Player. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching.